and most people have heard, you know, you know, some of your background story and stuff, but can you maybe explain to uh, people like, and you don't have to be specific, but maybe like when you got into crypto or how did you find this community? You know, did you hear about it through Richard Hart or a friend? You know, can you give us uh, some background? Yeah. So I had a really good friend who was a good, he's, he grew up as a, he was coding since he was 14 and he's in his fifties wow. now. And he started wow. his own, um, it was a fashion tech startup. It was called Fashion GPS. And it was the first time that people mm. could um, register and get their tickets for fashion shows. You understand, Brandon, fashion, my tickets still for like the fashion houses get delivered, handwritten, delivered okay. to my hotel the day before the show. It's just kind of a tradition. Wow. And so it's a, sure. it's a very old school kind of traditional. I mean, I kind of love it, but he, yeah, um, yeah. he digitalized, digitalized it, at least mm. in the States. So the New York Fashion Week was digitalized by, um, so there were, you, you registered and everything, your tickets and your seat assignments, everything was done online, right? And that was his technology. So then he sold it and like Mercedes-Benz Fashion Week was using it. So it was a big deal. He sold his company for, I don't know, a lot of money. And he put all uh -huh. his money into crypto, like Bitcoin. And I mean, obviously he's doing okay, right? So he has been trying to get me into crypto for years. And I was very resistant because I... I just don't, I'm not, I don't have a finance background. I mean, I crunch numbers a lot in my, my job, but it's different. So finally, he said to me a year ago, last summer, he's like, okay, you just, the one thing I want you to do, it's, 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 a, it's like an ICO for this crypto project that you have to put money in. He's just put in like X amount and just, and he helped me, mm. he helped me like do it and helped me get set up the wallet and everything. So I did, and it was for the Pulse chain launch. And so I had no idea what it was. I don't know the founder. I didn't know anything. I just put my money in, right? Um, and so when, after I put my money in, I'm like, okay, I might want to research a little bit about what I just spent all this money on, right? So I started to, <laughs> I, I couldn't really find that much information. So I started every, all the information was on YouTube, you know, as we know, because all the influencers were there, especially even from last summer. There's a lot of new mm -hmm. information, a lot more, even influencers out now. But at that point, there weren't that many. So I saw you, I saw um you know uh gerardo hexologist um rg3 like i watched all those guys and that's how i learned it i learned about hex because i was like what is hex because i noticed that everyone sacrificed hex more than ethereum were sacrificing this cryptocurrency that i'd never heard of so i started researching it and it, i was like this is amazing you get like this really high APY and like, it just, it seems like it's really strong. The community is really interesting. So I decided to invest in it. I contacted Wales only. And then he nicely gave me, we, we arranged to have a phone call. He was so cool. And he kind of walked me through it and he, I'm like, should I stake? And he's like, yeah, you have to stake. So I, I bought and I stake like right away. So I mean, I feel really fortunate that that's how it happened. And then it just happened that I got so into it and I was really interested in hex as i love the logo i like the community and i'm like gosh this is like a brand and this could be really cool to do something possibly you know um you know a project in fashion right so i contacted richard i've never told this story on stream it's the first time i told this story because i'm friends with him <laughs> and, and don't really talk about that either but sure, anyway. sure 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 so i um wrote him an email <laughs> Because I wanted to seem professional. I didn't want to seem like a stalker or a weirdo. So I wrote an email from my business email. And he happened, he never checks his email, email apparently, but he happened to check his email <laughs> and he wrote me back. And so, mm. and then it happened that we were both going to be in Paris the next week for Fashion Week. So mm -hmm. we met in person in Paris. So he's the first hexagon I met. Was wow. Richard. That's so, <laughs> so cool. <laughs> uh, yeah, it was cool. And then we just talked about, you know, potential projects you know, that could be done together. Um, not in crypto, it's a fashion like collaboration. And then um, and then we just got along really well, you know? So it, we just had these really great conversations. He, I mean, he loves fashion. Um, mm -hmm. We even went to some shops together so he could show me kind of what he's into and what he likes. And then, um, and we've stayed friends ever since. So that was, he's the first hexagon I met. And then it wasn't until December at the a meetup, which luckily for me was in London, that I met, mm -hmm. that's where I met everybody. That's where my funding gym, RG3, Fortendies, Motley, like I, I, I met a lot. I met a lot of people. So, and then my life changed from there. I feel like so many friends now, feels like a new family. And um, 
it's it's really incredible. So I'm trying to bring in as many people as possible, especially women. But I mean, also men. I'm just trying to bring in people. But I'm I'm definitely yeah. trying to empower my female friends to um, to work towards financial freedom and to go into more decentralized programs. And you know, and and also because of inflation, explaining what's happening to their money. Nobody understands mm. it. even the seven point nine percent. They so don't true. understand it. They don't understand that in five years that's forty one percent. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. Like that's devastating. So yeah, that's incredible. Yeah. So that's 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 my 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 little <laughs> hex story. <laughs> how I got into it. 